finally back, y'all. <laughs> It's your girl Sincerely Dre and I'm back today with another video. So as you guys can see, we're back in the back in the back of the booth. It kind of looks different. It's probably like the second time that y'all have seen this. And as you can see by the title down below, we are doing our dorm tour. So, you know, I couldn't do the dorm tour by myself. I'm going to do it by myself. So, I have a special guest with me today. Hello. <laughs> so, this is Natalie. She's my roommate. Hi. So, we're going to show you guys around our room. And, yeah, it'll probably give you guys some ideas on what to do with your room. So, if you're coming to UGA and you're a freshman, you might be living here for next year. You probably will be living here. If not here, you'll be in Russell or Brumby. And they kind of have the same layout and format. It's just probably like yeah, the closets are going to look different. Yeah, they're just going to be a little bit more updated. But as far as the rooms look, the same size. Yeah. So we're going to get right into the video and show you guys our room. So this is our door. So it's actually Christmas, so we just finished decorating our doors. It's Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. You have some lights and stuff, so we're gonna take you in now. <laughs> so cute, so cute. So, if you haven't seen it already, because I know a lot of people have been like, Driana, room tour, Driana, if you wanna see a room, here it is. It's cute and stuff. So this is my side of the room. As soon as you walk in, we have our lights. And then I keep a little thing right here to like put my ID and keys on and stuff so I don't forget it. Right here is my counter. I have my towel. I have pom-poms from the games. I have pom-poms right here because like at my house, you guys probably haven't seen it, but like at my house, on my mirror, I have pom-poms. Like anything just to make it seem more like home. That's what I've done. Here is my shower caddy. We're gonna do a video on what's keeping your shower caddy, so we're not gonna get too deep into this. And then we have our light. And up here is our air freshener. Rooms smell nasty. And we, we have, live right like next a, to a trash chute. Oh yeah, we have a million air fresheners in here. The first yes. thing out of everyone's mouth when they come in here is, oh my God, it smells so good. And I'm like, thank you. We have like 40 air fresheners. Yes. Like, because we refuse to let our hall, we live on a hall of boys, so the boys yes. stench. Seeps in. It travels. It's disgusting. <laughs> so that's one of our air fresheners. Just like we don't have to like remember to like spray. It's just gonna spray for us. Okay, so you guys already know from the dorm hall video that our colors for the room are gray, purple with accents of gold. So on my side, I have purple, and you'll see what she has on her side. In this part, I keep like just random stuff. So like blankets, air freshener, like extra air fresheners. What else? Soap, just anything that's extra that I don't like leaving out everywhere. In this part, I keep snacks. This is my laundry bag you guys saw in the dorm hall. I really love having this compared to other people because seeing the other girls drag their big things this is down so the nice. hall. I'd have to drag mine all the way down there. It sucks. <laughs> yes. So I'm telling you guys, get this or get one with wheels on it. It will save your life. Now, I don't know where you're going to put something with wheels because we don't have any space. We, we're maxed box. out on space right now. So, <laughs> yes. um, in here is my closet. Then we come right here. The this is my drawers. Don't stand on drawers. You remember this from the empty dorm tour. So I just have clothes in here, of course. Nothing special. Those are my shower shoes. So they stay in their corner because that's disgusting. We won't touch them. So coming over here, we're next to the bed. The first thing that you see is where I put my backpack all the time. And there's all my crap, because... <laughs> and then my roommate's backpack is here, too, just because this is where we put our book bags. This is an extra bag for whenever I want to, like, go out, but I don't want to take a big bag, but I don't want to take a small bag, because I always take bags with me. I don't know why. This is my stadium bag for games. Anything that you need a clear bag for. So... 
we have our lovely futon. Woohoo, Amazon. Yes. This actually goes down into like a full bed. You'll probably see that someday. Natalie usually spends most of her time over here. Because I can't study at desks. It works out though. Yeah, because it's not like one person is like, oh, get off. And yeah. the other person is like, no, I want to stay here. It's just like we both do our own thing and it just works out. So that's the other thing. When you're with your roommate, be okay with compromising. It's not just you anymore. You need to learn to get like it's over a shared, yourself. Shared small space. <laughs> yeah. Um. This is I forgot what it's called. Coffee table kind of thing. Yeah. Not even like a coffee. We don't drink coffee in here. But like it works for like seating and we had to bring anybody and then like it also works storage. as storage because we live in a shoebox. Again, we storage is key. Space. Make everything storage. <laughs> um. Under our thing is storage because like we said. No storage space. is key. This is another pillow just for people to sit on when they come in. This is Natalie's drying rack because you have to do clothes when you come in. Yeah, yeah. I have to hang all my clothes, otherwise they'll shrink. Heck, pool noodle. This isn't a pool noodle, but you know what I'm trying to oh, say. Yeah. On, like, under your thing, because this part right here is, like... Hurts if you yeah. hit your head. If you hit it, at least, like... You can still hit your head with this, but, like, it doesn't hurt as much. It's a soft um, cushion for the blow. Yeah. Now onto my bed. You guys have seen this comforter before in our dorm hall. Nice, cute-looking bed. It's gray and gold with accents of gold on it. I have my small pillow right here. My big, fluffy pillow that I don't really use that much, but I use it sometimes if, like, I sit on the futon. This pillow and then our satin pillowcase because you have to be... You have to take care of your hair. <laughs> Sad pillowcase. Um, now we're gonna move on a little bit more. On this side of the room, I have my towel. No, this is not a towel. This is your face rack. Face towel. <laughs> because you know you have your regular towel that you use on your body. You want a different towel for your face. I have my rag over here. This is what I use to like put like water in or anything like that so I don't have to come all the way off of my bed. I could just come to the, I guess, edge and get everything that I need. Over here, sincerely, Drew, you already know what it is. Um, Why it's up there, I really don't know because I can't really touch it. But I put my schedule up there just so that like, we already said earlier, I'm a very busy person. So. I use that just like when I have to schedule in different interviews or different stuff like that. I know for a fact I can't do anything during that time instead of having to go to my calendar because it's already right there. Um, <clears throat> other than that, I put my schedule right here again just so I know like teacher names and where classes are. This is one of my, what do you call that? That's one of my syllabus for one of my classes just so I know tests and like what we're going to be doing in class that day. The other part of the whiteboard, because remember I told you guys I was going to cut the whiteboard? The other part of it is cut right here. It says go dogs. I just put some pictures of me up there because that's what I usually do at the house. I have pictures of me around the room, so that's just cute. Um, This is our calendar that the school gave us. It's really helpful just so I know what day it is. Even in like high school and all that, I never knew what number day it was just because like I'm not writing the number on anything. So being able to see what day it is on there, what games we have that week, and like if there's anything cool, like we had budget bingo. I couldn't go to that one, but like just knowing that you could go to different stuff. And then it shows you like what movies there are. So if you ever want to go to a movie, you could do that. I watched some really good ones this semester. They show some good movies here. And this is just something that my parents wrote to me, I guess. I don't know when, but they did. <laughs> And then this is something that my manager gave me. Now onto my desk where I spend a lot of time. It's looking a lot of mess right now, but it's just a lot of wires because we all know I have too much technology. This is the computer that I use to edit all the videos. So right now it's updating so I can edit this video. Right here is the folder storage that I told you guys that I DIY'd. It has a planner in here which I don't use because I'm not a written planner type person I've moved to putting everything on my online calendar so it comes to my phone this is a notebook that I don't really use I use it sometimes but not really these are career guides I'm telling you if you go to UGA you want to get you one of these like this has everything in it from like how to do your resumes 
examples of everything. Um, this is a textbook that I have. It's really the only textbook that I use. The only class that needed a textbook. So it stays right there. I don't use it too much. Other papers and stuff. This is my pencil thing. I have lots of pens in here of all colors because you guys know I need colors to do notes and all that other good stuff. So yeah, just anything extra goes in here. I have a three hole puncher because everybody will love you if you have one of these. I don't know. I like to print a lot of stuff. So using the, like have one of these is really good to like hole punch everything in. This is the outlet thingy. I have a whole bunch of these because I have too much electronics, but you guys already know all of that from the dorm home. Laptop, not coming over to this side. I have another University of Georgia cup where I just keep a lot of pens. This is just if anybody ever comes in or if anybody needs a pen, I'll give them one of these just because these are extra instead of like the really expensive good ones. Now we're coming over here. This will turn the light on. This is our Shea Moisture Shimmering Body Lotion. Y'all, I don't really use this that much because, like, I don't really need it for real. But I like this because it leaves, like, a sparkly glow on your hands and it stays for a really long time. I got this to sponsor with Influencer and I actually do like it. So you should get this. Um, Victoria's Secret, I don't really use this on my body because these body sprays, they don't really last that long, but it's good for like, if you want to just spray around you or in the room or anything. Then we have another lotion. I was just at the end of it, so I put it in here. Then we have this little picture that I forgot where we got this from. I think they actually made this at some event that my mom went to. And it says made in his image because, baby, I'm cute. I don't know what you thought this was. <laughs> this is our, well, this is my desk light that I use because I spend a lot of time on my desk. So in order to, like, see everything, we use that. Because usually, like, you guys are seeing the light right on right now. We don't ever have this light yeah, on. Yeah, this is real. never on. So that's why I actually have the desk light here. And my mirror, this is another light. You can't really see it right now because, like, the battery's kind of dead in it. But I do use this sometimes if, like, I don't need as bright of a light as this. This is my light box that you guys already saw before. It still says congrats, Dre, because, like, come on now. You need a motivator. So, yeah. <laughs> These are my headphones, my binder that has everything in it. Like, all my classes are right here. Everything that I do and all of my classes are in here. I need this. My other laptop for schoolwork. Um, under the desk, we have storage because we live in a shoebox and you need place for storage. So in here, I put like my laundry, detergent, softener, anything extra that doesn't get used all the time goes in here. I have my heater because sometimes it gets cold, but I don't want the whole room to be hot. So I just use this so like the whole room isn't like boiling hot or whatever. Um, this is more storage down here. I also keep my sneakers right here because I did take PE this semester and I also like I rest and I do other things like that. So I wear sneakers a lot. So they stay over here for me to like just switch into them before I leave. Under here is where I also keep more storage. These are baskets so that like it can conceal everything that's in it. For this one, it's mainly just like medicine and beauty type stuff just in case i ever get sick which i'm surprised i haven't got sick yet i don't know how but <clears throat> we made it um i keep extra bottles right here just if i ever need water or anything disinfectant wipes if i ever need to clean anything off like i clean off my desk and stuff before i fold my clothes so that's that under here is my video stuff so i have my tripod oh no not video stuff it's more extra stuff I have my tripod, my hair dryer, storage, my external storage, markers, just anything extra goes in there. Then over here, I have books. This is my YouTube book where all your lovely videos get planned in. And yeah, so that's my side of the room i'm gonna hand it over to natalie to do her side of the room and just not really her side it's really shared but you know um this is the drawer in the desk it's 
I had to label things just so I remember where I put things because I forget everything. Um, keys, because I have forgotten my keys in the room before. A uh, bunch of extra stuff, water bottles. Again, shower caddy is a mess, so we're gonna ignore her. Uh, towels, robe. Um, up here, storage. I put my laundry on this side, and my side's gray, because her side's purple. Um, to kind of like keep the theme going. And then, yep. So, yeah, all my laundry's in here. I have to do that soon. Um, this is my bed. It's nice, I really like my comforter. I have like a mattress topper underneath it that makes it kind of like, memory foam because you know those given college mattresses are not the best at all um decorative pillows that i don't use um so we have a microwave in the fridge we split these i got this one three you got this one um we kind of decorated you know this is a little containment thing that we just have a bunch of stuff this is all my coffee i drink a lot of coffee it's not good, um, but I do it because I can't stay awake. <laughs> uh, Keurig storage container thing. My mom got a lot of this stuff just because she is really good at bargain shopping. Um, and we love it. Thanks, mom. <laughs> um, TV, PlayStation, Dries. She got this stuff. She went into that meeting when we had a meeting and she was like, I can get this, 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 and this. And I was like, I will get the futon and the microwave. And it was like, beautiful. <laughs> Cause she already had everything else covered and I was like, all right, let's go with that. Um, yeah, so this is a whole underside. It uses a lot for storage and stuff and yeah, just throw anything in here that we don't want to leave laying around again. Cause we live in a shoe box. Again, yes. <laughs> um, over here is my desk. I use this way less often cause I don't like studying a desk. So here I'm on this side. Um, this is the AC unit. I like it really, really cold, and Dree does not, so I kind of have it angled towards my bed so she doesn't have to, like, get, like, all of the cold. <laughs> um, but not in here, not, like, the whole thing. Storage, hair dryer, um, I have, like, three different hair straighteners in there. Um, a little fan box, just stuff that I need to repack that I didn't want to get rid of the box because it'll be easier to pack up when we have to, like, leave. So, yeah. Heck. I have makeup here, bring your makeup, try to bring whatever you can, and then store it however easy you can. Um, mirror for makeup, again, it lights up for, you know, gotta get that good Fancy! Lamp, um, again, whiteboard to tell me what to do because I forget things so I write it down. Let's see, laundry. Um, this is a thing that my mom made. Costco. I don't know how much it was, but yeah. She like made a whole bunch of collages because I didn't have any photos coming in because I didn't think that far ahead. I'm really bad at like planning ahead. It's so horrible. Um, just a bunch of extra storage. I got this. We made things at like this, what was it? I think it was like the involvement fair involvement. or something. And they had us paint frisbees for some apparent reason. Um, I have in a charge, ugh, I'm in a club called Charge. And we did like this Friendsgiving thing and we put little notes in each other's bags. So these are some of the notes I got that I really liked and I pinned them up on my board just because they're nice to look at and they're cute. Uh, stuff from classes and advising meetings so I can plan out scheduling, which was a nightmare anyway. Um, I have more pictures. This is my family. This is my family and a few friends. And then, yeah. So we have, if you notice, it's Marble. It's not real marble. Yes. It is the same thing that's on the desk drawer, but we just put like a wallpaper kind of thing on top of it because, you know, got to hide the ugliness underneath. Yes. If you guys saw the empty dorm tour, you guys would see like how the wall didn't look yeah. like this and so, the desk yeah. did not look like this. It's like Amber's on again and it's just um, wallpaper. It's all crepe paper. No, not crepe paper. Contact paper. Contact paper is what it's called. <laughs> Um, I'm so burnt <laughs> out, oh my gosh. Um, but yeah, and it looks really good, especially when you like, come in and everyone's like, ooh, they don't got that like just plain white wall going on. Yep. I don't have anything hung up here just because I don't have a lot of things to hang up. <laughs> I don't know. Um, Dre got the curtains, which was really helpful because I didn't know what to do for that, and so I just let her kind of roll with it because 
again, I don't plan anything. Um, so yeah, we got the air purifier because gotta knock it. Broski, Creswell cough. You don't want that. I don't want that. Um, yeah, and then underneath I have an extra one of those. It's just smaller, the coffee table, and like sleepers and stuff. I have a vacuum in my closet, but my closet's a mess. <laughs> Everything's a mess. I'm so sorry. Um, but yeah. And we kind of just divvy up cleaning and stuff. We kind of pick up whenever we can. I used to have like more things plugged in over here, but I had to do the extension cord for the lights on the door because <laughs> I got all out for Christmas. Yeah, I have that thing up there because I don't have one of those things that goes like right here. So I need some place to like put my phone so I wouldn't like knock it off the bed or like put something in there. So I have a little holder up there. It's falling on me like twice. <laughs> Um, so I gotta fix that when we come back. So, that's my side. So, this has been our room tour. We got, we touched a good amount of stuff. There's still like a whole lot of other stuff like under here. We have like some lights and stuff. Just, it's gonna be cute. You guys might see more videos in here, who knows. Um, we might do some other videos closer to the end of the semester with some more people about just like how to do stuff with your roommate as a first year. We can also talk about to... random roommates because we yeah. didn't, we just kind of randomly picked each other because we didn't really have any roommates set up. So we went in when we were picking rooms and I saw this room had one person in it. So I was like, okay, I'll take the other bed. And mm -hmm. a lot of people try to like freak out about finding a roommate, but it's actually not that bad if you go in random. So, yes. Yeah. And then we're actually like, I guess you, can say like a success story of a roommate. We don't hate each other. Girls, yeah. girls across the hall, one girl moved out, the girls next to us hate each other. They have the room split down the middle. Yeah. So a lot of people are moving out, basically. So we're not like I don't know, we get into that later on, but like we still get along in the room because you have to like communicate in order mm -hmm. to have a good I guess roommate situation. Yeah. But we'll do a whole nother video on that at another time because that's a whole topic in it. So, um, so yeah, this has been our room. We're going to be here for another semester. It has been cool here. If you're staying at UGA, let me know what hall you're going to be in. If you're coming next year, ask any questions down below because we are willing to make any videos or help you guys in any sort of way because... Yes. We need more people at UJ. So, as you guys already know, make sure you follow me on all social media, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, at I am Sincerely Dree. Make sure you do that right now. If you like this video, if you like seeing us, if you're coming to UGA, if you're at UGA, go make dogs. sure you go dogs. Comment that down below. Go dogs. Make sure you tell us what year you're in or what you're expecting to do. Smash the like button. Make sure you subscribe to see more of us and more of UGA because this is the first of the many videos that you will see. And as you guys know, I am your girl Sincerely Dree and I will see you in the new video. Bye!